Hey guys, it's Jack and today I'm going to be doing a video on my top 30 Taylor Swift songs. I did one of these, a, well it's kind of like my top 5 from each album. Um, I'm not including deluxe editions or um, Beautiful Eyes or Holiday Collection, just the 6 main studio albums. Not deluxe editions, just standard edition track lists. And I did one of these a while ago before Reputation was released. And my opinions on a bunch of these songs have changed in albums. And I've learned to love a bunch of new songs and other stuff. So I just want to do an update on one of these. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you want to see more of my videos, subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload a new YouTube video and follow me on my social media. And yeah, let's just get right into it. So first we have Taylor Swift by Taylor Swift, the debut album, Iconic. Um, these are not in any order for each album. I just have my top three or top five favorites from each album. So for this album, I have Should Have Said No, a perfectly good heart, which is my favorite off this album because I love that song. It's overlooked a lot. You should listen to it more. Um, Cold as you, I was there when she sang it for the first time live at the Red Tour in St. Louis, um, night two. Um, our song and Stay Beautiful, which used to be my favorite one, but I love a perfectly good heart too. This is a great album that is often overlooked and should definitely be listened to more often and appreciated because it is great. Okay, so next I have Fearless. I know this is the platinum edition, but they don't have the normal edition vinyl. But so, Fearless. Um, my favorite songs from this one are The Way I Loved You, You're Not Sorry, Tell Me Why, Hey Steven, and Forever and Always. My favorite song from this album is probably The Way I Loved You or You're Not Sorry. Ooh. But this is such an, another amazing album. It's turning 10 years old this year, which I can't believe. Um, this is such a great album. And I think The Way I Loved You is another really great, overlooked song, underrated. Um, so, yes, great album. And then there's the best Taylor Swift album, in my opinion, of all time, which is Speak Now. The number one best Taylor Swift song, in my opinion, that she's ever written and released is The Story of Us. Um, if you're my Instagram bio, it's the number one story of us, Stan. Um, this album is so good. She wrote it all by herself, which is incredible. So I think this album is so amazing. I'm gonna say that um, this album is amazing because they all are. So my favorite song from this is obviously The Story of Us. Then um, other songs that I love from this album are Haunted, Long Live, um, Mean, and Innocent. Innocent, um, I've been loving a lot recently and I've been listening to a lot. So yes, amazing album, best one in my opinion. Then we have Red, which deserved a Grammy. <laughs> so my favorites from this album are Holy Ground, The Lucky One, State of Grace, All Too Well, obviously, and Begin Again, All Too Well is such an iconic Taylor Swift song for Swifties. And um, but my favorite song from this album is probably the or is probably Holy Ground or the Lucky One. So yes, this is the era that I became a Swifty. So yes, this album will always have a special place in my heart. Next we have 1989. This is my first vinyl record, actually, the one I'm holding right now. And my favorite song from this one is All You Have To Do Is Stay, which is my stand song from this album. And then I Know Places, close second. And I'm Out of the Woods, Blank Space, and How You Get The Girl. Some of these are in order, but m most of these, I'm just saying my favorite songs. So yes, All You Have To Do Is Stay, best song, on my opinion, from this record. So yes, and then Blank Space I chose because of how she wrote it, like I love like the story and like all the amazing lyrics. Um, so that is why I chose Blank Space for this album. But this is such an iconic album, and I'm listening to it a lot recently because since Reputation came out, that's pretty much all I've been listening to. But I, the other day I listened to 1989, and I realized why I love it so much. So, yes. And now we have the beautiful, amazing Reputation, and my favorite song from this is I Did Something Bad. It has been the first time I listened to it. So amazing. <laughs> um. And then Don't Blame Me, because vocals, oh my god. Endgame, just because I love dancing to that song and I love the big reputation part, yes. Um, Getaway Car, and So It Goes. So It Goes, again, is underrated and amazing. And people need to love it more. So, yes, that's my favorite picks from this album. So, l let me know in the comments down below if you guys agreed with my picks, or leave your list down below. I'd love to hear your favorite Taylor Swift songs. Those are my top 30, or basically my top fave my top five favorite songs from each of the six standard studio albums. So thank you so much for watching this video. Leave a request down below for a new video. My next one's probably gonna be an unboxing because I ordered some stuff, or only like two things. But yes, make sure to follow me on social media, like I said before, and subscribe. So thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.